to in two grades. Today is Wednesday the 2nd of September. This is Room 9 and our wonderful body class. And we are broadcasting live from Beehive in Wellington. Today's activities are Library in the Library, Junior Soccer with Mr. Simpson, Middle School Netball with Mrs. Kennelly, League with Mr. Pilkington, Senior Polynesian with Miss Otto, Super Kids in the Art Suite. There are no birthdays today. And now it's over to our news desk. Kia ora, good morning, I'm Grace and I'm Athena. In local news, a new marking device that invisibly codes property could see burglars caught blue handed. New Zealand is the third country in the world to trial the product that marks property with a coded micro dot which is then matched against the database of, a database of registered owners. There will make finding the owners of stolen property easier. In overseas news, Libyan leader Colonel Gaddafi has paid for the Christchurch pipe band to go to Libya. The Christchurch pipe band will join a Scottish pipe band to play at the celebrations for Colonel Gaddafi's 40th, 40 years in power. The pipe band is travelling to Libya to play in a military tattoo for one of this year's most controversial celebrations. Today's weather. Today will be showery in the morning and warm in the, and fine in the afternoon. And now it's back to the studio. Thank you, News Desk. Yesterday's question was, where in the world would you find the reclining Buddha? And the answer is Thailand. Well done to room 11 and 8 for getting the correct answer. And today's question, where in the world would you find the eye? Find out the answer and tell Stella in room 9. Buzzing alone news, tickets will be on sale soon from the office. It is going to be a great show. Rehearsals after school today. Cast needs to be prompt. Rehearsals can start quickly. And that is all for today, Wednesday, 2nd of September. This is Room 9 and Room 2 wishing you have, wishing you have a great day. Hey.